They pushed mid. Hey guys, and welcome to my channel, Time is but a Window, and we're back to ESEA. Let's get away from those cheaters and see what I can actually do against some legitimate players. I can do that. Yeah, I know. Come here. Actually, never mind, player side. We need another person, A. I'm rotating, but I think there's one ult. That's a CT. Two dead. Shut him down. Three dead. Nice. Oh, my. Plus, the, the, the Morton's uh, yeah. With an incredible hold like that, we better not lose this round. Back to site. Okay. So as you can see, due to my teammate dropping that incredible three kill round right there to stop the rush, we were able to easily take the pistol round. Now as you can see, I am queued up with gummies, and we had actually discussed this idea before playing this game, where he's going to push up halls and I'm going to be there to get the trade kill in case he does go down. I got we got some problem. I mean, technically it went just as planned, we just didn't expect the second player to come in there and destroy me. Great job. Alright, we just won one of the potentially disastrous eco rounds. Let's see how we do on the second one. Nice. Great job, great job. And the next one down as well. Time to buy my AWP and actually see what I can do this game. One alt down. I'm gonna smoke your mid here. I smoked it already. Oh. Bottom. I smoked banana. There's a problem though. It seems they have actually taken the B site. They're up arch. Swan. And here I go for the retake 1v2 clutch. Let's see what happens. Damn, looks like we lost the first gun round, and you guys all know how important that round can be. I know for I'm getting out. I'm dead. I gotta reload. I'm coming out, right, I gotta reload. Spoiler! Fuck! I missed. I fucking whiffed. He's still in there somewhere. Hey, everyone knows I'm not the greatest rifler, but I flanked at the right time and got the final kill. Okay, time to go back to sniping. Let's see if I can do anything with that. Nice uh, hold. One left. And the answer is no. In fact, my teammates just utterly obliterated them and I didn't see anyone. It looks like the B site is on lockdown. As for me, back to camping out in apartments. Nice. You just fall back to site, Blue. Right. What's up, Mario? Oh my god. My movement is so bad. One more, one more. I knew it. No. I was gonna oh. call it too. Talk about a way to win a 1v2 clutch. Well, with stuff like that happening, we're gonna lose this game. <laughs> One down middle. One more mid. I think there's one more mid. Hey, he's legged! Legged! Legged. He could go B if he does, but he's okay. Uh, he would I jump. I don't think he ever would me there again. Just... And with that, we were back on track. The only problem was, since I did lose my gun, I couldn't exactly afford another AWP. Anyone want to drop me an M4? No, you gotta buy yourself. Mass. Yeah, do that. That way I can buy nades. Go, go, go! Thank you. No problem. Nades are important in mid, kind of. Molly and deep. They smoked mid. Okay, um, I'm coming forward, hold on. Is there more boost right here? Sure. They pushed mid. Oh yeah, that was totally planned. Who needs to see or hear anything to pick up some kills? Running B, running B, running B, running B. Nice. And while I will admit that round was pretty crazy, we found ourselves up 7-2 to two and things were actually starting to look like they were in our favor. As you guys know, this game can be quite momentum-based, and winning rounds like that 
especially that one and the one prior to that where I shot the guy through the flash and the smoke just kind of makes it so the other team feels like they're not sure what to do. Maybe their flashes aren't working. Maybe their smokes are off point and not covering things as well as they expect them to. So they start to doubt themselves and they stop throwing them. On this round, however, they decided to take the B site and I found myself in a 1v3 situation and decided I'd probably just be better off saving my gun. I'm gonna come over there to your side. Now here's a really great example of what I was talking about earlier. They came over and they did their setup like as if they were gonna take the A site, but instead of trying to actually execute through with it, they decided to rotate back and go back to B. The problem for them is that our teammates had actually pushed aggressive and held the choke point. So now with a few members down, their entire team was broken up into different places and slowly picked off one by one. On B. And here you can see again they go for that B site, thinking that maybe a full rush on that would have better results than the A rush. Just a B rush? It was, uh, they didn't smoke good. Okay. One more. In sight. Ah, he's pump, uh, bomb plant spot. At this point, they're completely frustrated. They're not entirely sure what to do, and you can see that they're going to try to do another eco round. This time, no utility, and, well, they just get destroyed. One more Good job. Halt. Last guy's halt. Nice. At this point, things are going so incredibly well, and I'm feeling incredibly overconfident, so let's see what I end up doing. Ah, one pit mid. Obviously a really stupid aggressive play that cost us the round, but I guess you could say it was just a heat check. Am I on fire? No. No, I'm not, but I seem to be doing really well through smokes and flashes. They're all going towards you. They're going to run. Alright, last round of the first half, and I just had a really strong reality check after the last round, so watch me play a little bit more passively. Get up there, get up there, get up there, quick, 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 quick. Uh, two oh, more, cool. two more up. They're in. One's a light. Damn, I expect you to get more than one there. It's I though. No, dude, I was reading. Nice. One on top emo corner. It's on top of the orange thing. Dead. Last guy, uh, banana. Get on it. Come on it. Guard me. Um, 11 4. And yes, the first half score, as I mentioned, is 11 4, which is quite good for the CT side of Inferno. While this is a CT sided map for the most part in these pugs, usually an 11 4 lead means that that team has it in the bag. But let's see if the other team can bring it back. Please don't block me. I think I might have heard one arch. Hey, one banana dead. Uh, Two banana dead. We're wrapping B. Probably one more dead. You think yeah. one more? Maybe. Yeah, most likely. CT spawn. Wait. We're behind yeah. them. Yeah. Just, just right. Nice. Dead. You guys have it for sure. Plant, one left. He was A. Yeah, I'm playing for banana. Another easy pistol round, and we found ourselves up 12 to 4. Time for those anti-eco rounds. And yeah, you guys all know how bad I can be on those anti-eco rounds. Ah, there's three here. Do some work, Jay. I'm hiding the room. That guy's speedway right now, speedway. Nice. Damn, Jay is on fire. Look at him destroy the other team. Now, as for me, I don't want to fall into the same pattern that the other team does. I want to make sure that I don't change my play style just because I had a bad round. Flashing your right side. Oh, okay, it's good. I'm gonna molly cock him. Two 
Oh my god, I suck. Can you kill him? Great job, Jay. Just rack up the fucking kills, man. Jay is on fire. We're on our first gun round, and we're only two rounds away from winning this as long as we don't lose a round. One right. No. Down. Maybe pit. I think one back pit. One's definitely pit. Gummy, see if you can get to pit. Well, so much for a quick, easy game, but they still would have a long road to go to bring this back entirely. Okay, so now we have two real options. One, we can save and buy up next round a full buy, or we can go for the force buy this round and have two save rounds after that. That is, if we lose this round. If we win this round, it means that we had to win it with less utility and possibly less firepower than we'd usually have on a full buy round. Weighing the negatives to the positives, you can see why I always want to do the save round rather than force buy. Spoiler, Dad. One on Mato, Mato, Mato. Great job. Planning. Watching men. He's library. And my game minimized. Hey, you got him though. Oh, I hit my Windows key by accident. That's the way to kill. That could have gone horribly, horribly wrong. I'm just glad that I hit the Windows key right after I got the kill. Is it video worthy? Yeah, if we win this and don't, they don't come back. <laughs> sure. They do. Oh, 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 shit. Maybe I shouldn't nap, not after showing that. One more uh, banana. Seagull. Two banana. Go away, bomb. Like low. We can just go away. Good game. Yeah, it is. Okay, uh. Yeah, I got this guy. Got this guy through the wall. I'm sorry. I'm all the way deep large, dude. That's fun. This is gonna come from mid. Holy arch. I got apps. Sight. Great play, guys. Great play. Good game, guys. Yeah, I'll make a video with it. It was good. It was good. It was Thank you, dude. Hey, it was really nice to meet you. Can I ask you a question real quick? Sure. Can you hear me? And, like, uh, like, is that, like, just something? You're not gonna believe me, but I'll put this in the video, too. It completely cut out when you tried to ask the question because I had an internet connection problem. Oh, yeah, same. No, 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 yeah, it happened to me too, but I was just wondering, like, um, like, you, like, you can't play, like, stressful things, like, how has that been for you in CS, because... I miss... It's a bit of a stressful thing. I really miss playing competitively, let's put it that way. I yeah. honestly kind of hate pugging all the time. <laughs> I, I want to join a team, but I know that if I start getting really into it, so I'm thinking about maybe doing, like, a series where I'll, like, join, like, an open team or something, but I can't go too intense. Like, I used to go to tournaments, CPLs, and all that kind of stuff, you know? But now yeah, it's like, cool, I don't know. Imagine, dude. I imagine it's like a basketball player that like has to quit because of injuries. You're like, you want to do it, but you just can't. Yeah, I'm just starting to get into competitive play, man. So, uh, yeah, I guess we're on two different roads. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, man, have a good night. it's definitely a fun road. You'll meet some amazing, fun people to hang out with and play games with. And, you know, you'll have some amazing experiences, if you, especially if you go traveling to tournaments. Yeah, man. Hey, it was awesome to meet you. Have a great night, man. You too, man. Good night. Man. See you. See you.